storms and stay ahead of the storms. We're on our way back from Sturgis. Uh, I'll do some updates of what uh, we all did there too. Um, but yeah, so we were on our way down to Buffalo. It was gonna be our next stop. It was about 80 mile drive. And on our way down, we ended up uh, hearing something like we had hit something on the road, uh, but there wasn't anything on the road. But it was a pretty pretty good sound of noise, so I thought that maybe the tire blew. And so we stopped and uh, we looked at the tire and the tire was all showing wires and everything, which was crazy because we checked before we left Sturgis. Um, or not Sturgis, but uh, before we left home for our trip to make sure the tires and everything were good. And uh, yeah, so not exactly sure what it was rubbing on or how it how it ended up like that. Maybe it was just the tire in general uh, it was old or whatever. Um, I don't know. But uh, anyway, it looks like this. So that's like the good part of it. But it's like that all the way around. And then there was like a big chunk missing out of it too or whatever. So yeah, we're not exactly sure what happened. Uh, we didn't feel any rubbing or anything weird. Uh, it didn't look like it was rubbing on anything underneath. Sorry if you can't hear me, it's really windy out here, but uh, I'll try to cup it best I can. But yeah, so got a tow truck coming. Uh, we found a guy that was willing to stay. Uh, he was gonna head home and everything. Um, Cause he, uh, he had been working hard through Sturgis, I guess. They were all kind of beat. Um, he kind of heard what happened though and he agreed to stay and uh, get a back tire put on for us so we can make our seven hour trip home. So uh, yeah, we asked some people uh, online and uh, one lady gave us his number. So uh, uh, the guy's name's Lyle from Speed Pros. Uh, and I think that that's out by Piedmont. So uh, yeah, thanks to those guys and everything. So hopefully we can get this all figured out and get back on the road and uh, get home. So probably going to be a late night, but I'll try keeping you guys posted.